On Wednesday, February 21, the then Deputy Majority Leader Alexander Penyomarkin redrew his amendments to the anti-LGBTQ bill, which seeks to impose a prison sentence, paving way for the bill to be considered for passage in the coming days. However, the Coalition of Civil Society Organizations and Interest Groups maintained the bill must be re-looked at. Ghana is a secular and multi-religious country with over 50 ethnic groups with different cultural practices and beliefs. Any attempt to create a single cultural value system for Ghana erases the beautiful cultural mosaic that makes us a unique people. It is for this reason that the Constitution abolishes all practices and laws detrimental to people's health and well-being, even in the name of culture and tradition. They noted the bill will undermine the media's ability to speak freely. Any person that uses the media to broadcast and slash or advocate on this topic faces a prison sentence of up to three years. This places a heavy restriction on journalists, bloggers, influencers, and various social media users who produce or publish content, especially those who work in the field of human rights. They want the president to block the bill when passed by parliament. They believe the bill in its state will negatively affect the democratic gains of the country. As a result of this, we urge the president not to assent to the Human Sexual Rights and Family Values Bill 2021.